So here's the course. Now, it's a 42-hour course, right? 14 weeks. I'm going to try to give you the whole course in 45 minutes. A little of the course. I speak quickly, but I'll do the best I can, okay? Here's the outcomes. When we all started getting together to think about this, we said, okay, let's get in a room and let's decide what we want the students to know and know how to do when they leave this course after 14 weeks. And we came down with 10 ideas. I am giving you kind of the short version of these 10 outcomes. In your binder, you have all of our outcomes. And one of the things that I want you to do, we want you to do, and you're gonna get into breakout groups, all of you look at these outcomes by the end of the day and a half and tell us which outcomes, if you were creating a core national curriculum, which one of these outcomes might you delete? What might you add? What might you modify? Okay, get everybody's eyes on this. So let me give you quickly some of the things. We want students, there are concepts, five key concepts and five key skills we want them to have. Concept one, we want them to appreciate the power of the information. Information that can do great harm or great good, but has great power in their lives, and we'll explain more. We want them to understand the nature and mission of the American press, the tension between the press and the government, how our system differs from systems all over the world. We want them to understand how journalists work, how they make decisions, why they make mistakes. We want them to understand on the internet, and we've learned this as the course has unfolded in the last two years, Rank is not the same as reliability, and that in the digital age, we are all publishers as well as consumers. And I'm going to come back to this. It's a key point. We want them to understand why news matters in their individual life and in the collective life of the country. Skills, analytical skills, not enough. This is not just about concepts. This is a course that really is about application of principles because they've got to come away with these skills. We want them to recognize the difference between journalism and other kinds of information. We want them to recognize the difference between news and opinion. We want them to be able to analyze the difference between assertion and verification and between evidence and inference in news stories. We want them to be able to, and I'll talk to you a little bit more about this, what this means, deconstruct stories, pull them apart whether they're on print, whether it's on broadcast, whether it's on the internet, pull them apart and put them back together again. And based on evidence and the reliability of sources, we want them to apply those kinds of principles across all platforms to decide what's reliable. And, and this is also something we've been nourishing over time, and it's become a bigger issue in the course. We want them to distinguish between news media bias, what bias even means, and how do you know it if you can see it in the news media and audience bias? 